We're going to find the magnitude of this complex number. Now all we need is the magnitude formula. And for the magnitude, it's the square root. So magnitude a plus bi is the square root a squared plus b squared. Notice the i does not get into the square root. It's the coefficient of i. So our a is square root 8. Our b is 9. Just grab that right out of there. If one of those was negative, I wouldn't even write that down because you're about to square. So if it was negative square root 8, that negative would get squared away. Plus 9 squared. Same thing if that 9 was negative. When you square it, it's going to turn into positive. All right, 8 square root squared is 8. 9 squared is 81. And we get 97-ish. And that's as good as it's going to get for us. Uh, when I uncover this, we may see a decimal here. And the square root of 97 is between the square root of 100. It's a little less than the square root of 100, so it's a little less than 10. And if you look right here, that's a little less than 10. So that's the number you would get. And I believe square root 97 should be accepted as the answer to this.